What's good folks, Rudd's here. I'm gonna do a uh, quick how-to video, tips and tricks video, if you will. Uh, one of the viewers on the channel quite a few months ago asked me to do a how-to on lathering Barrister's Reserve. So I have some right here. This happens to be the cool scent. Um, asked me to discuss how to lather with both a bore brush and a synthetic. So we'll tackle the uh, bore brush first. So I've got a really wet, soaked bore brush here. I'm really going to wring it out. I'm going to wring it out so it's essentially dry, really, really dry brush. And I'm going to load this really heavy. Um, Barrister's Reserve is notorious for getting stringy when you load it, as you can kind of see here in the uh, puck. But you want to push past that with your bore brush. And just keep loading that brush up. Bores tend to uh, pull a lot of lather and a lot of soap down into the bristles which sometimes can make it hard to uh, pull out of the brush when you uh, get right to your face. I wouldn't add any water at this point it's getting quite pasty um, and that's okay because what we can do is once we uh, get this on the face we're going to uh, add water slowly so you can see nice and uh, oh, the lighting's not very good too bright in here and I start with painting to push the lather around I'm gonna stick to this side of the face push that pasty marshmallow like lather around now I'm going to dip the tips a little bit and begin to agitate some more. This is going to take a lot of water. So I'll try to move fast, but it's going to take quite a bit of water to get this where you want it. because of how heavy I load a bore brush to ensure that I'm getting enough um, lather on my face and in the brush for a three pass shave. So this is the fourth time I've dipped the tips. And as you can see, it's starting to get there. As it becomes more hydrated and has that glossy sheen which I'm not sure comes across on the camera or not. I kind of move to more paint-like strokes. One more dip and I think we're gonna be there. Yep. So, start dry with a bore brush. After you've soaked the brush, wring it out well. Develop a very pasty load into your brush fibers. And then dip the tips and agitate and add water slowly to the process. That was five uh, dips of the tip for me. Synthetic brush dunked in water, bring the water out similar to the um, what you did with the uh, bore. Again, load the soap. Pasty, pasty on the uh, puck. Dip the tip just a little bit. Go right to your face. As you can see, the synthetic had a little bit more moisture in it, so that paste is not quite as uh, cumbersome. Dip the tips once. Agitate, 
paint. Agitate again. Paint still dry, I can feel it. One of your key indicators will be you can almost feel the brush the brush dragging through the uh, lather on your face if it's too dry, particularly with the barrister's reserve. So that was number two for for dipping the uh, tips into the water, and we're already close. Paint paint that excess water right into the lather. You can see it kind of dripping out of my brush a little bit from dipping the tips. And we're there. So that's how I would uh, tackle lathering barrister's reserve. And uh, it takes a little practice, but once you get it uh, dialed in, you're going to find that this is an extremely good lather. Uh, really nice slickness. Uh, some of the best slickness out there, and the post shave is also wonderful. As always, thumbs up the video if you enjoyed it. Comment below if you have anything to say. And if you're not already a subscriber, please become one. See ya.